Good afternoon, top four friends. I uh, have a quick video here on the chip shuffle uh, feature, let's call it. And this video is dedicated to my friend River, who asked about this event today. So let's uh, take a look at how it works. So for chip shuffle, you basically have your three options that pop up now i've already done this on here but the first thing you really want to do is where it shows the 420 there that's your little emblems you want to click on that and you want to do this one down here which is 99 cents because if you do that you'll get 60 engraving points which is already better than you can get anywhere else but then you'll also be able to get the gift which gives you a mysterious amount of engraving points could be 60 it could be 120 it could be more it's a good way to cost effectively add up your engraving points so that you can get a uh, you know get more engraving points to use in this event so the way it works is it's going to give you certain <laughs> attributes and those attributes will be on the chip you get if you use that so for example here i've got you know these three available to me if i don't like any of them i just hit shuffle again it costs 20 gems here your first shuffle will be free after that it costs 20 gems and then eventually it starts costing 50 gems so let's just take now let's assume i like the second one here so I'll, once I've found one I like, I'll hit add. Now, as a uh, quick trick, if you don't have a lot of these coins up here, you're probably not going to get very far unless you really want to spend money on it. So don't waste a lot of gems looking for a perfect one. Just add any one. If you do have a lot of coins and by a lot i mean like over a couple thousand of them then take the time to find a chip you really like but now when you hit add it's gonna lock it and it's not going to come back here so you get okay you get nine to choose from one of these nine is a gold chip and that will have those attributes um i think two are purple and the rest are blue once you get the gold, there's no reason to keep going. If you have picked something and you don't really have a lot of coins that you just want to do the minimum, the first draw is free. It doesn't cost you any coins. So just click anything you want. You get that and then you'll get a chip that has those attributes, right? If you have coins, you can keep going and it'll cost 60 I think eventually it'll cost 120, 300, and then 600 by each draw. So the first draw is free. The second one costs 60. I think the third one costs 62. And it gets more expensive in coins for every draw, which is why you every day you want to you do that 99 cents for 60 and then get that free gift up here. If you don't want to go past this, you got this one chip. Look, it, it may not be a good chip, but it's good for fodder or whatever. And you're done with this event for the day. Hit abandon. And you're back here. And when it refreshes, I'll be able to start again. But that is the basic gist of the chip shuffle event. Again, guys, take a minute to like and subscribe. Cookie out.